wheelchair was stolen, along with his independence. But tonight, that young man tells us the theft was the best thing that ever happened to him. CBS 2's Jennifer McLogan has this update now from Roslyn. Getting himself out of a wheelchair, standing, taking real steps with a walker for the first time. Vinny Pinello, graduate of Roslyn High School, living with cerebral palsy since birth, says life is grand. By the miracle of God, I, I am able to walk. It was a heartless crime, say his parents, Carmela and Martino, that took their son on this incredible journey. We were there three years ago when police charged teenage neighbors from Flower Hill with stealing Vinny's electric wheelchair, taking it on a joyride and trashing it. It was a hate crime. You took away my independence. But that crime inspired Vinny. While waiting two months for a new custom-built wheelchair, he sought advice from his doctor at NYU Langone. Vinny was told he qualified as a candidate for intrathecal baclofen therapy. A pump was surgically implanted, releasing a drug into Vinny's spine, with only a chance it could control his severe spasticity. Vinny's family says life has changed for them all. Out of a hurtful and heartless crime, blessings are overwhelming them. He was able to show the world that there is always hope for every child out there that has a disability. Has actually helped me walk. Something that was your dream for your entire life. Yes. It takes a village. These are volunteers helping with Vinny's daily physical therapy. Every three months, the protein pump medication is infused, and doctors say Vinny could even get better. From Roslyn, Jennifer McLogan, CBS 2 News.